Hey there, it's Jay Rowe here on The Jay Rowe Show, bringing you guys another delicious and simple vegan recipe on the show today. And if you take it way back into family traditions and celebrations, usually there's one or two really key things in each tradition or culture. And today, I'm gonna be doing a vegan version of a traditional Mexican drink. I'm gonna be doing horchata. Now, normally they drink this on Cinco de Mayo for celebrations, but this recipe is so simple and delicious, you can make it any time of the year, hot or cold. So, first thing we gotta do is grab a blender mug. And our base is gonna be simply one cup of room temperature filtered water. Now, the key to horchata is not just the taste of it and trying to mimic that authentic flavor, but getting the right texture. So in this case, we're gonna be using a half cup of soaked hazelnuts. Now to get a little bit more creaminess, you wanna add a quarter cup of cooked white rice. And it can get kind of sticky in there. <laughs> For the sweetness factor, you can do an agave, you can do maple syrup. In this case, I'm gonna go a little bit unique here and do a raw coconut nectar, two tablespoons. Next up, we're gonna do a full teaspoon of ground cinnamon. A little bitty pinch of salt. And then last, we're gonna bump up the protein and the creaminess in this recipe by adding a half scoop of our Warrior Blend protein. Now, it's time to rev it up and get ourselves some vegan horchata. As I mentioned, you guys can do this hot or you can do it cold. I like a little bit of coldness today here. It's a little bit hot. So I'm gonna add right around a cup of ice cubes, which is about four to five big ones. So let's add a handful of ice cubes. Mmm, smells good. Let's give it a taste. Pretty darn good. The flavor of the hazelnuts is really interesting here because it has like kind of a, like a smoky undertone, but definitely authentic. The cinnamon, the sweetness, it's right on par with the traditional horchata. So if you guys dug my recipe for horchata here today, give this video a thumbs up and let me know what's your favorite traditional Mexican recipe to make. Let me know in the comments below and I'll try and make a version here on the show. So this is Jay Rowe here on the Jay Rowe Show, you guys enjoying a quick and easy vegan horchata. And if you guys have not yet subscribed, subscribe to this channel to get delicious, vibrant vegan recipes and living tips every week. And I'm also thrown down with the Sun Warrior Tribe, so be sure to subscribe to their channel as well. This is really when a ball jar shines, right? Check that out. Perfect. We're gonna put a little cinnamon on top here. Yeah, that's perfect. All right, so guys, I'm out of here. Thanks so much for hanging around and enjoying this horchata recipe, and I will catch you guys on the flip side. Peaches. The real thing to do would actually be to like, take a blender full of this and go down to like Echo Park in East LA and give it to all the Mexican people down there and be like, yo, I made some vegan horchata. You guys like this? Muy rico. I think I might do that. Stay tuned for that possible video. See you guys.